Hello everyone, we're on page 19. We're going to be looking, we're going to be identifying these properties, the reflexive symmetric, transitive, and substitution. All right, example three, identify the property illustrated by each statement. If 3a minus 4 equals b, and b equals a plus 17, then 3a minus 4 equals a plus 17. So really, you could think of all of this as being capital A. Think of this as being B. You end up with B again. And think of this as capital C. So what this is saying is if A if A equals B and B equals C, then A equals C. That is the transitive property. Next one, if 2g minus h equals 62 and h equals 24, then 2g minus 24 equals 60. So what they did was they replaced the h with 24. They used this information here and replaced h with 24. So this h right here is getting replaced with 24. That's substitution. All right, try to do the guided practice here, pause the video, and then resume. All right, here's three, here's how you do it. You have negative 11a plus two equals negative 3a, then negative 3a equals negative 11a plus two. You could think of this first part as being a equals b, okay? And the second part is being b, then, b equals a that is if you look that is the symmetric property for all real numbers a and b if a equals b then b equals a symmetric property Okay, read through this key concept down here at the bottom of the page. 